Hi, I'm Chef Mike. I'm up in the fries, culinary 411. This time we're making swordfish with vermouth Dijon glaze. So let's get started. Today we're using the frozen swordfish steaks. You want to thaw them out naturally in your refrigerator and pat them dry with a paper towel. Next we'll add some salt and fresh cracked pepper. Repeat for the second side. Now today we're going to use a non-stick pan, so we want to get that heated up on a medium hot heat for at least two minutes first. Now we'll add our oil, swirl the coat well, and we'll add the swordfish steaks. Now we're going to give them a nice color on the first side for about two to three minutes, then we'll turn. Now after the first turn, you're going to lower the heat to a medium low, and then we'll continue to cook them, turning every two minutes till they're just done. You can tell they're done when they start to flake apart. These are looking pretty good. Let's set them on a clean plate and we'll set them aside to rest. Now to the same pan we're going to add our butter and our garlic and we'll saute for about 30 seconds. Now before the garlic has a chance to burn, which will make it very bitter, we'll add our vermouth. Now it's very important for the sauce to work, you let the vermouth reduce by about two-thirds. Let's add our cayenne pepper, our Dijon mustard, and a couple shots of hot sauce, and we'll bring it together. Now it's going to cook quick in about 30 seconds before it thickens up nicely. It's an easy pan sauce. Let's go ahead and serve it up.